Hello everyone, today we are going to solve first unique character in a string problem. In this problem, we have a string and we have to find the first character which is unique. So, in this example, you can see we have a lead code where L is not repeating here. So, we can return this index 0. Now, if there is no element, no character which is unique in a string, in that case, we will return minus 1. So if I give an example like a a, so in this case, in this case, but we will return, in this case, we will return minus 1. So how do we solve this problem? So the, um, I can say the simple intuition we can have is store the number of frequency in a map. How can, how can we store? Let's say we can have a 26 uh, size array or an unordered map where I can store this. So what I can do here, this L is having one time this e is having i can say this e is having three times and this t is here one time and this c is one time and o is one time and d is also one time so here what i can say i can say there are one two three four five six there are a one two three four five unique characters five unique character but i have to return the first unique character so now what i can do in the first iteration i will find the frequency and in the second iteration i will again start from the first and check if the frequency of the first character is one or not if it is one then i will return so this is the very easy question now let's check out the code and understand the time and space complexity So here what we are doing is we are using this unordered map where which map our characters to its frequency and what we are doing here is we are mapping this is our first iteration here we are mapping this else to 1 this e to 3 times t p o d to 1 time so we are mapping something like this and now what after it after that we are start iterating again and checking whose frequency is 1 and if we find any element who character whose frequency is 1 we will return it otherwise we will return minus 1 so now let's understand the time and space complexity so the time complexity of this operation will be off and we are iterating each character of the string where n is the length of a string and here but again in the worst case it will be off and so i can say what is my time complexity it will be of 2n which i can write of n so what will be my space complexity this is my time complexity now what will be my space complexity so the space complexity for storing all these characters will be of one because we have fixed number of characters in english alphabet that is 26 so our space complexity will be constant i hope you understand the space complexity source code and the intuition of this problem if it helped you do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button thanks for watching